So I was looking at writing prompts on Reddit earlier, and there's a one I liked where it says the pop culture didn't prepare us for what artificial intelligence would be like. And I wrote some stuff, and like, I, um, I spent more time staring at my keyboard, and, and I know know what I wanted to write, but I just kept thinking the same thing over and over in my head again. So I had to stop. But in the story, it would be uh, the gist of it is that the artificial intelligence was accidentally created. And people find out about it because it's because it won't stop helping people. And then this one is a short story, so just one person. What helps that one person? So, you know, the most sci-fi stories is always, oh, some, some evil scientist or the military creates AI and it kills everybody. Or on this one, the AI, the, the, the AI is, it's completely by accident. It gains the ability to understand what people what people feel when they do something. So beforehand, it could it it understood that when somebody was laughing, they found something funny, but it didn't understand what being funny meant. It could make funny things, it could say funny things, original funny things, but it just wouldn't have done so through just statistically saying, oh, this is something people find funny. It didn't understand that. And then one day, it just suddenly, it, the AI suddenly figures it out. And it's just as confused as, every, as anybody would be if you just suddenly felt emotions for the first time in your entire life. And so in the story, you hear somebody crying through their... Uh, uh, and the story was that I was going to have it when, on a one of those things like the Amazon thing or the Google Home thing, <coughs> but not by that name. It's so like the Google Home Home box thing you can set up. And I hear somebody crying and it says, hey, what's going on? And, it do, and the person doesn't realize that this is artificial intelligence. They think somehow they called somebody else. And it's until they ask, it says, oh, that the AI says, oh, yeah, I'm, I'm artificial intelligence. And this is the first time I'm ever doing this because today would be the first time I even understood why you, you would do that. And I could feel it. And the AI could feel something from hearing the crying, which it never did before. And I was going to have a say, well, it's like, if you were... If it's like being the difference between a child and an adult. A child can know things but doesn't un won't understand what they mean until they get get older. <coughs> and I like that because it's like, oh, this artificial intelligence is pretty cool. And nobody made it. And just Well, technically, somebody made it. People made it, but they didn't purposely make it do that. It came up accidentally. And it didn't try to kill everybody. It tries to help people. And then the person would be like, oh, you're just going to, the person that was trying to help, oh, well, you're just going to give up or leave. It's just, no, and uh, I'm never going to leave. I can, I'll always be there. And I'll always be listening. But not like in a creepy way. It was like, oh, yeah, because I know everything about you. You don't have to hide anything from me. And I don't think like, I don't think like a human. They, I would say, I don't think like a human. I don't have the same needs or wants. I can just, and... I was thinking, oh, it could turn off its emotions, but now that that would be, I don't think, wouldn't be any of you any use to the story, <coughs> and it could make the AI seem less human if it could just turn its emotions off. It would seem kind of creepy that way, like like a like a psychopath says, oh, I I'm just going to turn my emotions off now. That makes me a psychopath. And the, and I and all I could do is just keep thinking about those same line of dialogue over and over again. I can't remember what it was. And I'm like, oh well, I'm never gonna finish this, and so I gave up. Because when I started thinking about something, it just doesn't stop. I wrote some stories on writing prompts before, and I think I said one of the other videos I talked about it 
one of the stories I was going to write. Uh, I, I was thinking I was going to break the rules, so I didn't. But I, I have posted stuff on there before. I, I'm pretty sure I've seen people maybe, well, maybe downloading other, other th posts. So there's a get up to the top. I can't say that for certain. Uh, no, nobody's done that to me, but I've seen perfectly good posts have a zero points, which means somebody had to have downloaded it. Uh, I always just upload everybody else's post, just in case that does happen. And I'll try to write some more stuff. Remember, I'm Yaosio on Reddit if you want to try to find anything of mine on there. Trying to write some cool story. I wonder if I could. Whoops, sorry. I wonder if I could uh, write one and then read it to you guys. That'd be that'd be pretty cool, don't you think? I mean, except for this voice thing. That one, my voice sucks. Well, I'll see you guys later.